This is really a medicinal brew to keep people from getting scurvy. Beers of Joy is steeped in history, and it follows several stories, all involving Americans passionate about this beverage. How passionate? Oregon brewmaster Tanya Cornett once did this after visiting a German brewery. I literally left clothes in my hotel and brought back a case of Doppelbach. There's a, um, a guy we interviewed who has a, a brewery in LA uh, and he made a real good point that beer is the beverage where uh, the haves and have-nots can all have it. We found a world that fascinated us. Beers of Joy looks at people who aim to make the best beer. There's also a chef whose specialty is cooking with beer, and students studying to become master cicerones, the highest certification level for those with an exceptional understanding of the beverage. When you swirl the beer and bring it up to your nose and get that first smell, there's so many things going on. It's like a symphony, and you need to be able to pick out that perfect note. The test to become a master Cicerone is grueling. Were you rooting for everyone to pass? As a director? No, uh, I gotta tell you, I was rooting for something great to happen <laughs> that would be uh, dramatic, and the film definitely pays off in the drama department. Yeah. As a human, I've wanted them all to pass. The beer lovers who made this movie did some globe trotting to get their stories, but they also learned about the beer world right here in America. I think we're more creative here. They can put oysters and orange peel and anything you want to do. So it's Chocolate. been exciting to be a part of what they're doing in the U.S. because it's, it's definitely cutting edge. Beers of Joy is available now on demand, Amazon Prime and iTunes. George Pinocchio, ABC7 Eyewitness News. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Click the ABC7 logo to subscribe to our Eyewitness News YouTube channel.